I want to go home. No, Jamal. We live here now. This is my house. <laughs> what are you talking about? I live here now. Alan, where did you go? I meant in the amusement park. Oh. I still want to go home. <laughs> um. Why am I getting creeped out? Nothing's happening. I think that's why I'm getting creeped out. Where's Chad? You're probably getting creeped out because there's trees everywhere. And you're just like, what's hiding behind them? This is the opposite side of the... Okay. Where are you? Callum! Right there. Continually delayed by the incompetence of the handler... Handler... Hot handlers? Is that what's up? Yeah. The... Ugh, crap, this is really bad. The... I can't read that word. Yeah, get real close to the screen and tell me what it says. Because <laughs> I'm not doing that shit. The problem is that they that the lo uh, they are locals, and so they believe a lot of the rumors about what Old Man Henderson used to have done. They grew up on those tales. Every time a bolt comes loose or a wrench goes missing, these fools are crossing themselves against the black magic. <laughs> of course, that is why I chose the site over all the other potentials. Solomon Island is a nexus for dark energies, and the thought of all that power just disappearing beneath the earth here, it makes my skin crawl. Not the fact that it's fucking- you admit- you have admitted that this place is fucking cursed. <laughs> I called in for- I called in a few favors in Brooklyn and got someone at the academy to see if they have any interesting books about local history. It turns out they do, and it, tur and it turned out that Old Man Henderson was- has some pretty strong connections to Brooklyn, the, the Brooklyn crowd. Perhaps something he wrote will help me find the piece, or the piece of the plans that are missing. All right. All right. Fantastic. If y'all couldn't hear me, that's because I had to stand up. Yeah. Does it pick up from back there? Yeah, I got it from back there. Okay. That's why I started speaking up. Your mom's pick up. Yeah. See, there's the bumps on the audio. Anyways, let's continue moving. Your mom moved. When she left you in this Don't park. Don't be afraid. Dude, I would... Actually, I'd probably really enjoy this in real life. Stay where you are! Travis, find the baby. No. That's the real terror. Parenthood. I thought it was the lag. The lag is also the real terror. There's something this game is doing to your uh, computer, and I'm not sure what the hell it is. I wonder if it turned... Oh my god! He's up there! He's up there! Travis! Travis! He's up there! Where? Oh, no, wait. No, it's just one of those signs. Fuck. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, I see what you saw! Okay. Lag, lag, lag. Smiley faces. Alright, here we are. Where is the baby? Oh, uh, there's no. So they are going to close this place down. Doesn't surprise me. Stay inspection report, September 22nd, 1980. Look who was right. Called it! Inspection result, unsafe, close the park. Inspector's comments. After touring the park, riding the rides, and uh, viewing the starting number of incidents suffered here in the park, it is this inspector's opinion that Atlantic Island Park should be shut down until Na Nathaniel Winter complies with all safety regulations. While I understand that there is a sensitive political relationship between Mr. Winter and the Senator, I nevertheless suggest that such political consideration be set aside in condemning Atlantic Island R Park. The rides at first glance appear well constructed and maintained, but the sheer number of incidents in the park during the last few years and during construction lead me to believe that there is something wrong at the base level of construction and we should close the park and fully investigate these flaws. To wit, sorry, there's something in the background that's freaking me out a little bit. Same. To wit, here is a partial list of the f fatalities in the park since opening only two years ago. Family of three killed when a roller coaster cart derailed. 14 separate incidents of broken bones and crushed ribs while riding the Octotron. 
three suicides from the top of this Ferris wheel, a child seriously injured on the escalator, over a dozen children reported missing in the House of Horrors since its construction. What? Yeah. One report of a drowning in the Tunnel of Tales. Okay. There was something bumping the boat from underneath Oh my it god. In the Tunnel of Tales. Wait, what did it say about the Octra Trump? Four broken bones and craft ribs. Oh, that's, that's barely anything comparably. The sheer volume of incidents means that this is my strongest recommendation. That... Atlantic Island Park be closed immediately. Sign David Wolseth. Guess I'm to slow this thing down to hop on it. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, we're gonna die in this park. <laughs> Buzzkill, bruh. All right. I'm worried that this game's gonna freeze on a fucking, like, horrifying face. Right? Okay. Alright, here we go. Well, we're fucked. We're gonna die. But mostly you. Technically, I'm not even playing. Hmm. So, why don't you internally monologue when these rides are going off with you being the only person in the park? Yeah, I know. Why don't you do it now when you can't really move? Um, We're gonna see some weird shit. Yeah. People come into your life for a reason. Oh my god. Oh, I asked for it and now I wish enough. it was not happening. After that, he mostly just drank. Things were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. He came in with some workers, but he Did didn't you just hear a cat? try to flirt yes. or cop a feel like the others. That's a squeak. He just oh. ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. I don't know how to describe that walk. We talked and laughed and eventually kissed. It felt like love. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Callum was made that night or one of the ones that followed. <laughs> Oh, you fucked I think it has to be that him. night. Oh my god. That one perfect night. <laughs> You're right. Don and I moved in together, but then, well, he died. Oh. According to the supervisor, his safety harness failed when he was working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment, and then gone. Sometimes Why do you still come here? <laughs> what is wrong with you, you stupid bitch? Three months pregnant with Callum. <laughs> Fairy tale fucking over. <laughs> And you still keep coming here, you, you stupid keep bitch! Keep coming to this fucking place! And you still ride the fucking Ferris wheel? What the hell is yeah, wrong with you? Your husband died on the roof of it! Oh, god damn. Although, so far, the only creepy thing about this ride has been her fucking judgment. And that. And that. And that. It's Callum. I mean, not Callum. What's the word? The... Dawn. Dawn. Oh, that's awkward for you. Huh? Yeah, it is. <laughs> that's awkward. You? So no Ferris wheel, huh? Nope. <laughs> if Never she ever again. wants to work on a Ferris wheel, I'm just going to be like, no. <laughs> Saw that in a game once. Bad juju. Dude, I bet you the Ferris wheel's going to fall apart now. Can you hear it? Yeah. Oh, God, I hate this place. Alright. Is that the way you came, or? No. The way I came was the other direction. Because I came around the back of it. What the fuck? Is that a plane, or what? I don't know. That's one of the things. Oh, my God, that's one of the Ferris wheel things. Go check it out. After Radix out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say hey. Oh, no. No. Refuse. Okay. 